Yes, you read that title correctly. By the way, back in the woods or back in the forest. I saw a couple comments saying back in the forest. I am all in crypto. Just like some of you are all into a specific crypto, whether it's Bitcoin, Caspa, or a meme coin, God forbid. I am all into crypto. I am doing this because I have high conviction in crypto as an asset class in general. And I also believe this bull cycle, like we've been seeing signs of, is going to be massive. Keep in mind, even though I'm all in, the majority of my cash is in the market, it is risky. And I'm definitely not recommending you guys to do what I'm doing. The reason why I'm doing it is because I'm not living on my own yet. I'm young. I can bounce back. I have recurring income coming in. And it's worth the risk to me. But it may not be worth the risk to you. If you got kids, a house, a mortgage payment, maybe you're in school, you got to pay tuition, you live on your own, you got to pay rent, got to buy a new car, whatever. For me, my car's paid off, I live at home, I pay a few hundred dollars rent and a couple bills like insurance and phone. I, I don't live a very luxurious life, so I don't have a ton of things to pay for besides essentials. I'm not going out and drinking all the time. I'm not going on vacations all the time. The last vacation I went on was like five years ago, which is a long time. I think it was Miami. I'm not going out drinking all the time, eating. You know, I try to make, you know, healthy food at home. And I also don't have a girlfriend. I'm not going on, you know, numerous dates. I'm single. Uh, you know, I'm very busy, so I haven't really had time to date. But it has saved me a lot of expenses in that category as well so my expenses are pretty low and i just know this market this cycle is going to be massive a life changer one and even though i've been sacrificing for years now you know for over two years i'm like what the hell what's it worth delaying you know moving out right now why risk you know going out blowing money right now when i'm happy sacrificing when i'm happy with this delay gratification now if you feel like you're not happy, maybe you're stuck, you're working two jobs and you use your time, you know, your free time to go out and, you know, expend a little bit and divert some of your stress into more, you know, enjoyable, you know, things, then okay. Then obviously you do what you feel is best. You know, I always say how de-stressing and taking your mind off crypto is essential because if you don't and you're just watching graphs all day, you can drive yourself nuts and that literally be like crazy watching graphs. But for me, I'm okay with taking the extreme measures. I notice people that go all into anything, whether it's what I'm doing, going all into crypto or all into a crypto asset itself, the conviction has to be there. If the conviction is not there, then that is the ultimate gamble. For sure, without a doubt. So you best believe whatever you go all in on, whether it's cash, crypto, an asset, whatever, gold, you better believe in what you're doing because if you don't, you're going to be tested. You know, I said before, I'll say it again. Manipulation runs this market. Emotion runs this market. The whales and smart money run this market. The faster you realize this, the better off you're going to be. It doesn't mean they're bad people. It doesn't mean you can't win. It just means you have an uphill battle to reach your goals, your end destination, success, which is my end destination. I'm sure it's yours too. So... I know it's getting, it's freezing today, but I know it's getting warmer out in general. Maybe where you live, it's warm. I know I have a few people that are in tropical climates. So I'm very jealous, but it's getting nicer here. And I know once it gets warmer, we see barbecue season come back, vacation season comes back, the bars are gonna open up, the restaurants are gonna have outdoor seating. And I know I'll be tempted to go out and enjoy myself. And I probably will in spurts here and there. And like I said too in a previous live stream, I will be slowing down my dollar cost averaging at some point. I will, because I've been sacrificing so much, I'm okay with, you know, taking my foot off the gas pedal, per se. But I'm still aggressively buying crypto at the moment because I know these discounts aren't going to last for long. Because I know this opportunity of 2024 is going to fly by so quick. We are, what, a week away from Q2? of this year, many of us think Q4 is gonna start the real rips or at least, you know, put us more into an upward cycle. The bull cycle takes time, by the way. 
it's not just one, two, three, snap your fingers, 100K, 150K Bitcoin in all coin season. It takes time. But uh, we could see some Black Swan Catalyst events, who knows? The SEC pursuing Ethereum was a great one. <laughs> I look at Black Swan events as a great catalyst to buy big discounts in the red. I don't get afraid like the majority of people do. In fact, I get happy and I act with urgency and, and say, oh my God, I hope these assets stay cheap so I can buy when I get paid. <laughs> if you feel the same, then drop your comment down below. But uh, regardless, I can't stress enough how important it is to recognize this life-changing opportunity. The sun is setting behind me. That is pretty much where I see the position of crypto in the market right now it is settling behind us and we want to catch it we want to see it we want to be there when it sets and we want to leave with profits that is such an amazing feeling to think about right right now i am outside i am freezing but i know warmer sunnier fun days are ahead and what i do right now in this moment tomorrow the next day the next week the next month the next three to six months can transform how my life is day by day and years to come years to come leaving my job this week saturday's my last day was the first step to being who i am doing what i want to do my ideal lifestyle and then crypto my investments my portfolio that's going to ensure my family's future i want to retire them my goals have not changed i want to be financially free myself yes but i want to help them out so if you're feeling like you're lacking motivation right now, or you feel like you might get distracted, remind yourself of the goals that you want to achieve. Why you started investing in crypto since day one. Because I'll tell you this, if you have goals like mine, where you want to help yourself out, help your family, leave your job, start a side hustle, go on vacation, travel, relax, immediately in that moment, all these thoughts of trying to party, go out drinking. Hey, man, enjoy enjoy the moment. Go to a bar, have five shots. All that doesn't sound as exciting anymore because now you have priorities. You're prioritizing your future over your present day. And that is a powerful and much needed transition in life. That's why I motivate myself a lot by remembering why I got into this market in the first place. The thought of what's going to happen when I when the first day next week when I leave my job and I feel like, wow, this is it. It's going to be an amazing feeling. I already know it's going to feel amazing. And the day that I come out of this market with a million dollars or more, which I definitely think is possible for me in my situation, I'm going to be so happy that I sacrifice over two years to do this. Those days of eating peanut butter and jellies at my job, working double shifts, not going out not going on vacations and i know many people who were saying at the time when i was making videos john you gotta de-stress you gotta enjoy life what are you doing just you know staying in your basement doing nothing and i'm like well i'm fine if i wasn't fine if i wasn't happy doing this i wouldn't do it but i had my eyes on a prize i had my focus at a high level it still is and even though we're closer to to realizing our goals Nothing has changed. I am still as determined and focused as ever. I am so proactive in this market, you have no idea. And I'm not saying this to gloat and say, oh, look at me. I'm telling you, the future of what you want is right there. Just like the sun setting behind us, you can achieve it by the time this market is over in one year. One year of sacrificing whether it's working a lot, feeling stressed, feeling tired, feeling drained, every single dollar you save or better reinvest into the market instead of you know, blowing it on food that you don't need that you can make at home, drinks that, you, that probably aren't healthy for you anyway or going on so many dates or taking your spouse out on vacations over and over. Listen, those things are fun to do, but if you can delay that for another year, to invest into the market so you can do that for years on end without anybody saying hey put in a vacation week bro hey why don't you uh call out sick and i'll just fire you you know without having to deal with anyone and do whatever you want to do at your own time at your own pace that is a remarkable sacrifice for a future that is as good as it pretty much gets so what i'm trying to say is don't mess it up don't f it up Think about the long term. A lot of you guys are thinking too nearsighted. That's why today in my live stream, I was kind of giving some tough love. 
to some people who were trading, you know, blue chip cryptos for ones that are already going up in profit in green. They chase pumps. They chase roller coasters, not realizing every roller coaster has to start before it gets to the top. And once they get to the top, they eventually go down and you have to get off. But people learn, unfortunately, through the hard way, the tough route. Experience. I said it before, right? Experience is the best teacher. And, you know, one of the reasons why I started this journey was to learn, was to educate, was to remind, motivate, and document everything I've been doing, every mistake I've made, every win I've got, every loss I got. I share everything because I know when I look back at all this stuff that's been taking place over two or three years, one, I'm going to be thankful I went through this. Two, I'm going to be glad that I can witness everything all over again. And most importantly, helping you guys along the way. That's something I'm going to love seeing when this bull cycle is over with. Seeing you guys make so much money, change your life. So I'm already seeing some members in my Discord who have made a lot of money already. It is an awesome feeling to see you guys change right before my very eyes. And I cannot wait what the outcome of this bull cycle is going to produce. Both in life change and profit and also character. Character development and confidence in the feeling of success. I am all in. I am all in because this is what I want. This is the future that I want. These are the sacrifices that I want to make. You have to decide now how bad do you want this ideal lifestyle. If you're not happy right now, of course. I know some of you guys are you know, happy, you're enjoying what you do, and you know, you're just here to supplement your income. But I know a very large percentage of you guys want to change your life the old fashioned way and do it the fastest way possible. And crypto is the only market I know that can change your life in less than two years which is why I am all in to this market. And by the way, if you want to reach out to me, talk to me, see your crypto on buy and sell and trading, be a part of Q&A live streams, or be part of a support group of like-minded investors who also want to change their life, then I encourage you to join Patreon and Discord. I'll leave a link in the pinned comments down below. But anyways, now I want to hear from you. Are you also all into crypto? And if so, what is your ultimate goal for this bull cycle? Drop your comment down below and let me know if you enjoy this video please leave a like really helps so much that being said i hope you have a great day and i'll see you in this one